People calling right eight when speaking, may I help Hello? you? Hello. Hello. Uh, I, I'm answering. My name is Ken. I'm a bell linesman. What what's going on here? I'm sorry. Uh, are you mentally ill? No, I'm not. This is right eight. Can I help you? You know what, I've been getting calls all day long that I'm calling somebody, and I'm not calling anybody. Well, there must be something wrong with your phone, because the phone rang here, and I answered it. Why, why is this fucking happening? Hey, this is Patrick. I'm going to help you. Do you want to give me your name and number and I'll give it to the police? What for? You, just because uh, John read the receipt wrong to you, you're going you're gonna to act this way? Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? <laughs> is this the way you act? I'm sorry? Gregory Stevens, you called me five or six times here, and I, I haven't called you. Are you? Are, is your phone ringing, and you think it's me? Sir, I don't know what you're talking about, and you sound awfully drunk right now. It's possible that maybe you have a prescription here, and the pharmacy was trying to contact you. I'm not taking some kind of drugs. I didn't say drugs. And your name again is fucking asshole. Why are you so mad at me? Why do you keep calling us? Sir, sure, I don't know who in the fuck you are. This is Rite Aid Pharmacy. You keep calling us. What do you Stop. want? Stop these annoying phone calls, you fucking asshole. Dude, you are so drunk out of your mind. I'm trying to tell you, if we're calling you, it's probably because you have a prescription to be picked up. We got along fine. Are you taking some kind of drugs or drinking? What are you talking You're the one who is slurring your words and burping over the phone. You're the one who's drunk. Oh, my God. Why am I doing what, sir? Hello? Sir, let me have your name. My name is Fred. I'm a bell linesman. What, what's going on here? What is that name again, Fred? I'm Fred Herbert. Fred Robert? Yes. Why are you Fred so Robert. mad? Yes. Why All right. are you Thank so you. mad at me? We will I, take I, care of this so we will stop calling you. Let me take care of this and stop calling us. I've got your phone number and I'm going to ring your fucking neck. Hello? Hey, you know what? <laughs> you fucking asshole. You had the wrong number. <laughs> Hello? Just say Look, we realize hi. this is a prank number. Could you please stop calling us? We need this line for our customers. No. Oh, my God. Just because John read the receipt. All right, this is Travis. I can help you today. Hello? Hello. My name is Fred. I'm a bell linesman. What, what's going on here? Can you say that one more time, sir? You know what? I've been getting calls all day long <laughs> that I'm calling somebody, and I'm not calling anybody. Uh, it might be one of our automated systems that is letting you know about something. You have I the wrong number. Do you want to give me your name and number, and I'll give it to the police? Uh, sir, this is 
a actual business where if we do send you something, it is something to deal with something that we actually offer you. So it's either something, a prescription from the pharmacy or an automated voice message system hey, for you the know photo what? department. Hey, you know what? I've got your phone number, and I'm going to wring your fucking neck, you fucking asshole. Have a great night, sir. You have the wrong number. Hey, this is Travis. I can help you today. Yeah, just because uh, John read the receipt wrong to you, you're gonna you're gonna act this way. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the way you act, sir? The first time you called us, you never told me what you were calling about, and then you also asked me to stop calling you. Yes. I've never called you today. I'm not doing it. Call people except for the pharmacy that tells you when a prescription is ready. You're the one calling me, acting strange. Sir, I'm not calling you. Stop we these don't actually call people. Stop these annoying phone calls. You had the wrong number. Then I'm sorry, sir. We'll try not to call you again. But I'm not sure about the pharmacy. If they do, they'll call you. Do you want to give me your name and number and I'll give it to the police? Sir, the only time we would ever call you is if it was a pharmacy. It had something to okay. do with the pharmacy. We are not calling you as the front end. The front end only would call you with an automated system Start that tells you when the photo is ready. Right. Uh, if you don't know, then then this is uh, BS. I've called uh, 13 times today. Just say hi, Fred, and I will know this isn't a recording. It's not a recording. I'm telling you the only okay. people that would call are the pharmacy. I can patch you through to them if you needed to ask them if they've been calling you. But as far as I know, I'm okay. part of the front end of our yes. store. We have not called you at all today. Yes. No problem. Give me one second, and I'll patch you through to the pharmacy. Okay. Hello? Hi, hello. This is the pharmacist. Can, is it, I'm so sorry. How can I help you today? Uh, are you mentally ill? Oh no, sir. I'm not. I've been. I, I've. I've. Uh, I've been. I've had. I. I. I've. I've been. I've taken some drugs or drinking. Okay. Okay. Do I need to call um, the police or to yes. call the hospital to help you? Do you need help? You know what? I've been getting calls all day long that I'm calling somebody and I'm not calling anybody. What is your phone number so I can see who, why the system is calling you? What number? Are, are, what is your number? Hey, you know what? Sir, I can help yes. if you just give me the number that, that the system is calling so I can make it stop calling you. The number is 909-595-2264. Five, five, yes. Is it area code 757? Yes. 595-2264? Five, five, two, yes. two, Yes. Okay, hold on one second. Are you okay? Do you need someone to help you? They've called 13 times today. 5952264. Yes. Nothing, nothing's coming up. Hold on. Um, Hang on. I'm Hang so on. sorry. I don't know. Does it say, what do they say? Is it automated? Hang on just a second. Okay. <laughs> Oh, what? 
Hello. Hi, I'm here. Um, is it an automated call or is it an actual person like yes. talking to you? Yes. What's your Very. name? Do you fill with Rite Aid? My name is Fred. My name is Fred. I'm a bell bondsman. What's going on here? I don't know. I'm confused as you are. What's your last name? My name is Fred Herbert. Fred Herbert? Herbert? Fred Herbert? Yes. Fred Herbert. Let me see if anything comes up for you, Fred. Okay. Well, listen, I don't have anything coming up, and I apologize for the wow. call that you're getting. Um, what number are you calling us back at, sir? I don't, I don't call you, so I don't know who's calling you, and I'm so sorry. Hello, what's I apologize. your name and number? Hello, what's your name and number? Hello. 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 I. My name is Fred. I'm a bell bondsman. What, what's going on here? Who is this again? You call me five or six times here, and I, I haven't called you. Are you? Are, is your phone ringing, and you think it's me? You had a couple drinks tonight, Fred. Yes. We got along fine. Are you taking some kind of drugs or drinking? Tone, please leave a message for Timothy. At the tone. When you are finished recording, press pound to cancel. Press star. Hello. Aiden Recovery. This is Eric. How can I help? Can you hear me? Um, not very well, sir, but I, I, I can hear you, but not very well. My name is Fred. How can we help? A, my name is Fred. I'm a bell bondsman. What, what's going on here? You need what now? Why is this fucking happening? What, what, what's happening, sir? What's going I on? I've been, I, I've, I've, uh, I've been, I've had, I, I, I've, I've been, I've taken some drugs or drinking. Okay. Why are you taking drugs? I, I can assist you into getting into a 30-day inpatient program, 30 yes. to 45 days, actually. Is that what you'd like to do to get things turned around? Yes. Okay. Let's see here. And apologize to anything that happened. All right. And uh, and what's your name, sir? Please. Can you hear me? I'm Fred. Herbert. Yeah, wh My name is hmm? Fred Herbert. Fred. Yes. Oh. And what's the last name, Fred? My name is Fred Herbert. I'm Fred Herbert. Herbert? Yes. Okay. I'd like to talk to you, officer. I'm sorry? I'd like to talk to you, officer. Do you like to talk to an officer? Yes. I know you're uh, this is not the, You haven't called the police, Fred. This is a uh, detox and rehab placement service. I, I I don't understand why you're so mad at me, sir. Who's mad at you? you just because uh, John read the receipt wrong to you, you're gonna you're gonna act this way. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? It's just the way you act. Nobody's angry with you, Fred. What's uh, what's going on, buddy? I'm not taking some kind of drugs. 
Well, it kind of sounds like it, Fred. You sounds like you're a little bit um, under the influence there, buddy. Yes. You're not. You're not. You're not making a whole lot of sense. Which usually happens when um, you know when I'm when I'm either drunk or I'm on some type of narcotic. But that's okay. Yeah, it's not not the end of the world. I just want you to get some help. Hang on just a second. All right. Hang yeah, on. Sure. Hang on just a second. Do you hear me? Not really, not really, uh, Fred. I really can't. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the what, way what you What responsibility? Act? Well, what's your name and number? You just called me. My name is Eric. What's your booking number? My what number? What's your booking number? I don't have a Birking number. Why are you taking drugs? Why are you doing this, sir? Yeah. i tell you what, Fred. I think you need to sleep it off, buddy. Get yourself a nap. No. Okay, get some sleep. And then give me a call. I'll be here. I'll be here another, huh, another eight and a half hours. I so I'm not going anywhere. I I'd love to speak call. with you, but I, I don't think I don't think we're getting getting any place right now. You're you're a little too a little too uh, inebriated. I didn't All right. call you, sir. All righty. Why are you so mad at me? Yeah, take a. No, I'm, I'm not mad at you at all, Fred, but I got a lot of people to help, buddy. A lot of people that are just out there begging for help. So I got to I got to work with them too. Why are all you right? at, Why are you acting like this? Yeah. All right, Fred, you take a nap, man, and when you get up and you feel a little bit better, give no. me a call, all right, buddy? We'll be here. Goodbye. All right. Goodbye. You fucking okay, so asshole. Bye -bye. Recovery, this is Brandy. How can I help you? Hello. Hi, this Hello. is Brandy. How can I help you? And your name is what? This is Brandy from Aiden Recovery. How can I help you? My name is Fred. I'm a bell linesman. What What's going on here? I'm sorry, sir. I can't hear you. Say it again. I've been, I, I've, I've, uh, I've been, I've had, I, I, I've, I've been, I've taken some drugs or drinking. Okay, are you looking to get yourself into an inpatient treatment program? Yes. All right, do you have anybody, uh, okay, do you have state insurance? Do you have private insurance? Yes. Yes. All right. What type of insurance do you have, sir? Bell Vines. What's the name of it? Bell Vines. I can't hear you, sir. Say it one more time. Bell Vines. Bell Vines. What type of... Okay. How do you get that insurance? Is it through the state? Is it through your employer? Gregory Stevens. Sir, can you hear me okay? Are you there? Yes. Oh, what's... Hello? Aiden Recovery, this is Mark. How may I help? Hello? Hello? Yes. Are you there? I'd like to talk to Carrie. To who? Carrie. I'd like to talk to Carrie. <laughs> May I ask you speaking, please? I'm Fred Herbert. My name is Fred. I'm a Val Vinesman. What, what's going on here? This is Aid in Recovery in South Florida. Just say hi, Fred, and I will know this isn't a recording. Hi, Fred. Bye. Okay. Okay.
I've been, I, I've, I've, uh, I've been, I've had, I, I, I've, I've been, I've taken some drugs or drinking. Hello? Are you, are, yes, I'm here. Are you looking to get help or? Yes. Yes. Oh, what? <laughs> Hello? Yep, I'm here. So you're struggling with alcohol. Are you currently covered under any types of health insurance? No. All right. What is your zip code? Excuse me? What is your zip code, your postal code? I've been, I, I've, I've, uh, I've been, I've had, I, I, I've, I've been, I've taken some drugs or drinking. All right. What's your zip code? I, I'm, I'm not sure whether it's the 760 number or the, uh, the other number that I've given you. What city are you in? I'm Fred Herbert. Hello? Yep, I'm here. And your name is what? Mark. <laughs> Okay. I, I I don't understand why you're so mad at me, sir. I'm why not are mad you? you? You're the one calling me, acting strange. What what's going on here? Hello. Yeah, I'm here. I mean, are you looking to get help or? Yes. 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 All right. I need you to get a pen so I can give you a number to call that can help you since you're not covered under any types of health insurance. Okay. Let me know when you're ready. Hang on. Hang on just a second. Yeah. Can you hear me? Aid in recovery, this is John speaking. Hello? Yes. Do you want to give me your name and number and I'll give it to the police? Okay, you're calling a crisis line. Sure. What can I help you with? Sir, I don't know who in the fuck you are. Oh. You well, you called ass. us. What Do you number? need some help? Do you need we a drug and alcohol rehab for yourself, sir? Is that why you're calling? Yes. Because you're addicted to drugs and alcohol? I'm not taking some kind of drugs. Oh, okay. And your name well, you're calling again. a treat. You're calling a rehab center. And your name again is fucking asshole. Oh, that's nice. I've got. How your, old are you, sir? I've got your phone you number, and I'm gonna ring your fucking neck. That's nice. We are tracking your IP address, and we're having law enforcement sent to your house immediately. Wow. 30 more seconds. Wow. I'd like to talk to Carrie. This isn't about you. This isn't about you anymore. It's about your son. Hang on just Carrie? a second. Carrie? Yes. Yes. Spell your first and last name for me. I'm Fred Herbert. 
My name is Fred. I'm a bell bondsman. What, what's going on here? All you have to do is reach out to us and ask us. Hello. Earlier today. Yeah, I'm waiting for the adult to come to the phone so that we can discuss uh, treatment options for the, the sick individual who's prank calling us. I'm Fred Herbert. My name is Fred okay. Herbert. Fred? Uh, Herbert? Yes. You call me five H or six times here, and I, I haven't called you. Are you? Are, is your phone ringing, and you think it's me? Okay, sir. See, he, the only reason we would reach out to you is if you reached out to us first. Okay. Thank you. I've been, I, I've, I've, uh, I've been, I've had, I, I, I've, I've been, I've taken some drugs or drinking. Mm -hmm. Yes. And apologize. <laughs> That's good. Well, you should probably get some help for that. And apologize to anything that happened. I'd like to talk. That's great. Um, well, let me, if you don't know, then then this is uh, BS. Okay. Well, I can try to look up your information here, or you can t you can continue to verbally berate us. Uh, but I'm here to help you. So, what? Spell your last name for me again. Hubert. I'm, no. I'm Fred Herbert. Herbert, H E R B E R T? Yes. Hello, what's your name and number? Herbert Turner. Fred. Is it Frederick? F R E D R I C K? Or just Fred? Yes. Okay, great. This is Diana with Aid and Recovery. How can I help you? Hello. Yes, hi, this is Diana. I'm a bell bondsman. What, what's going on here? I'm Fred Herbert, and I'm a bell bondsman. Okay. You and I have well, gotten along. Well, this is Aid and Recovery for Drug and Alcohol Rehabs. Are you looking? Yes. I'm not sure. Okay. So what are you looking for? Are you looking for treatment help? Well, yes. I'm sorry? Yes. Okay. All right. Well, let Is me see what we can do. Have you ever been to a rehab center before? Yes. Okay. All right. And what's going on? What are you struggling with? I smoke weed. My life. Okay, I'm having a little trouble hearing you. Am I on speakerphone? I smoke weed. Hello? I'm still, uh, yeah, I'm having a lot of trouble hearing you. Yeah. I smoke weed. It's ruining my life. I started smoking weed in 1970 at the very tail end of it. Being a cop, out of okay. the evidence locker. Okay. All right. So you're struggling with marijuana. Do you? Um, and then is is weed the only thing you you just smoke and weed? Do you do anything else? Do you drink? Do you? Yes. Do you use any anything else? Yes. Do you drink alcohol too? Okay. Walnut. Okay. All right. So, what's what's your phone number? Because. I think I'm going to have to call you back because I don't think we have a good connection. I'm having trouble hearing you, and I don't want to um, make you have to repeat everything. I don't know. The number is 909-595-5000.
2264. All right. And what's your name? Fred Herbert. Fred Herbert. Fred? This is Fred. All right, Fred. Okay. Hey, I'm you know really he good from? right now. I'm going to keep talking to you until I have trouble again, okay? Um, so do you, right now, do you have medical insurance that would help you get into a treatment program? Well, yeah. All right. What kind do you use? Excuse me? What kind of insurance do you have? This helps me to narrow down what program I can get you into. Homer Scott. Homer Scott, okay. And is that through work, or do you buy the prog the uh, insurance, or is it Medicaid? Yeah, yeah. What is it? What kind of I'm, insurance is it? How do you have it? I'm a bill of linesman. Okay. Well. Hello? Your insurance through work? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, do you have your insurance? Do you have your ID number there? Yes. Okay. Nine one seven. What's your ID number? Nine one seven five eight six four. Okay. And what's the phone number on the back for customer service? Three one zero three six two nine nine seven seven. All right. On your card, does it say Frederick or Fred? Does it is Fred your full name? Fred, Fred Herbert. Fred Herbert. Just Fred Herbert? Okay, gotcha. This is uh, Herbert right. Belvines. Okay. All right, Fred. Um, you're looking to get into a rehab where you actually go away for 30 to 45 days and get treatment help, and that's what you want? Two years? No, 30 to 45 days. Yeah. Okay, okay. All right, what's a good email address for you? Herbert Belbines. Okay. Well, it would cost you $500. What's that? Well, it would cost you $500. Okay, what's your email address, Herbert Bill Bonds, and what's the rest of it? I'm an up one. Compton? Okay, what's your email address? This is uh, Herbert Bell Bonds. How do you spell that? No, I, I've, I've got it, but what is the rest of the email address? The last name's Rogers, right? Herbert Belvines. Are you looking at my ad right now? No. Okay. Are you trying to get treat? Yes. Okay, are you trying to get treatment help? Yes. Okay, then I'm. I need you. I need some things here. What is your email address? What website do you have up? I don't have any website. I don't need a website. I just need your email address. This is uh, Herbert Belvines. Yeah. Tell me what your question is before the next person calls. What is your email address? Herbert Belvines. At? The number is 909 595 Two two six four. Okay. All right. What's your date of birth? Two nineteen fifty four. And what year? Fifty four. Okay. All right. What's your street address? One forty seven North Euclid Avenue in Upland. 
You see the big red letters that say bell bonds and the neon clock in the window? No, I'm not near you. Why? Uh, what state are you in? Go ahead. Long Beach. Okay. Yeah, I'm in Florida. Um, what's your zip code there? 410. Okay. I, I apologize. It's okay. What's your zip code? Excuse me? Hello? Are you still there? 410. Yeah. Yep. Now, what's your zip code? 9175864. Okay. Okay. Hang on. Hang on just a second. Hang on just a second. Mike, turn on the TV, you fucking asshole. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. All right, so I'm going to give you a call back in a bit, all right? Okay. Okay, okay. all right, thanks, Fred. Are you called me? Here. I don't oh, know what's going on with my phone. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to give you a call back later on tonight, okay? And Charles, you're at 275-7176. This is, okay, I'm going to give you a call back, okay? What's your name and phone number? Diana. No. Okay. And the phone number is, okay, 844 Five one five six. The number is nine oh nine five nine five two two six four. All right. Oh, okay. All right, thank you. All Good right, night. I'll call you a little bit later. Good night. Good night. Happy New Year to you. Aid in recovery, this is Brian. How may I help? Hello. Hello? This is Fred. This is Fred. I'm a bell bondsman. What, what's going on here? What do you mean, Fred? Can I get some help, please? Uh, yeah. Let, what do you need help with, Fred? I smoke weed. It's ruining my life. I'm sorry. I, I didn't understand that at all. I smoked weed. I started smoking weed in 1970 at the very tail end of being a cop, out of the evidence locker. Okay. I go are, you to, uh, to get into a are you looking to get into a treatment program for that? Yep. Okay. I started this in 1970. Okay. And are you covered by any medical insurance that would help with the cost of a treatment program? Well, yes. Okay, and what insurance were you covered by? Homer Scott. Homer Scott? Yes. Okay, is that through your employer? Well, okay. Elvines. I'm sorry? Herbert Belvines. Okay, but, well, but what's the name of the insurance company, though? And his name is Homer Scott? Yes, but what's the name of the actual insurance company? Like Homer Scott. Shield, United Healthcare. Homer Scott. Okay. Okay, friend. 
Fred, what's your first and last name? This is Fred. My name's Fred Herbert. Yeah. The number is 909-595-2264. Okay, you said, can you say your phone number again, please? The, num the number is 909-595-2264. Okay, do you have your insurance card with you? Yeah. I probably got 150, 200 of them. Okay, wh okay, Fred, what's your, what's your date of birth? Excuse me? What's your date of birth? Two nineteen. Twenty five. Hello? Yeah, you said two nineteen. I didn't hear I didn't hear the rest. Two nineteen. Fifty four? Okay, 19. so February nineteenth, nineteen fifty four? Well, well, yeah. It sounds like you're okay. on a computer phone or something. No, sir, but you, it seems like you're breaking up a little bit. What's your phone number? Give me your phone number. 844-444-5444. Okay. Who did I call? This is Aid in Recovery. Yes. I'm not understanding you. When I call you, your phone echoes. So. You call me five or six times here, and I, I haven't called you. Are you? Are, is your phone ringing, and you think it's me? Well, sir, I'm having a hard time hearing you as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hang up, and I'm going to give you a call back. I have your number. Give me your phone number again so I can call you back when I find out something. What What do you need to find out? Well, I, I'm not understanding. Walnut. I'm sorry? Walnut. Walnut. Is that what you're saying, walnut? No, sir. That, I, I haven't said anything about that. I, I was saying I would give you a call right back because I'm having a hard time understanding you. You want me to give you some phone numbers and maybe you could check in a couple hours? I thought you, I thought you gave me your phone number, Fred. No, I did not. Okay. Fred, it, it seems like you're a little inebriated at this point in time. Do you, do you want me to, to, to run your insurance to see if I can get you some help? Well, yes. Okay. Do you, do you have your insurance card with you? Excuse me? Hello? in recovery. This is Casey. How can I help you? Hello? Yes, can you hear me? This is Fred. My name's Fred Herbert. Can I get some help, please? Sure, man. That's something I can help you with. Are you um, still tell there? Tell me a little bit about what's going on. I was smoking weed. I started smoking weed in 1970 at the very tail end of I'm having some trouble hearing you. I smoke weed. You're smoking weed? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Can I what get other some kind of stuff are you doing? Walnut. What was that? Walnut. Okay, you drinking or doing any any other kind of stuff at all? Yes. Okay. And are you looking for like an inpatient kind of a well, treatment program? 
Yes. What is it exactly that you're trying to do? Yes. Okay. All right, having, man, that's something I can help you with. Are you uh, I'm for not having. Is it accepts your medical insurance? Are you looking for one that's um, you're looking to pay out of pocket for? Yes. Or? Yes. Okay, which Five. one? I asked you two questions. Is it five hundred dollars? Well, no. I mean, it's an inpatient treatment program is going to be substantially more money than that. You said five thousand dollars. For an inpatient treatment program, it's it's probably going to start around twenty thousand dollars. Give me some more information. Wow. Okay. Um, well, well, actually, what I would need is more information from you to see which be which programs are best going to be able to help you. Wow. So you're not looking you're not looking to use any kind of medical insurance. You're looking to self pay for a treatment program. Yes. Okay. Um, do you have a couple of minutes to answer some questions for me? Yes. So I can see what kind of places are best able to help you? Yes. All right, Fred. So what's your date of birth? Excuse me? What's your date of birth? 2 two, 1954? 2-2-1954? Two, two, yes. Okay. And what part of the country are you located in? California. Southern California. Okay. Um, well, like what part of Southern California? That's that's a pretty big, big area Com to consider. Compton. Okay. Um, you're in Compton? Yes. Okay, and what's the zip code there? Three one zero three six two. Okay, that's that's too many digits. Two seven five seven one seven six. Okay, um, you're still giving me too many digits. Should be a five-digit zip code. Okay. Three two zero seventy eight. Okay, it's three two zero seven eight. Yes. Okay. All right. Would you have a, a couple of minutes to go ahead and do a um, clinical assessment with me? That'll give me a better idea of you know what what kinds of help I can I can buy yes. for you. Yes. Okay. Is this something you've ever done before? Yes. Two years. Okay. How many times? How many times have you been to treatment before? Two. All right. Sounds good. If you don't hear from me tonight. Okay. You've been to treatment twice. How long ago was the most recent time? Ninety-two. Okay. And are you looking to stay in California or are you looking to get out of the area? Yes. Okay, which one? I asked you two questions. Long Beach. Okay, I don't work with any programs in Long Beach. The programs okay. that I have that would be in California would be located in like the Temecula area. Okay. Is that something you're open to? Yes. Okay. And what's a good email address for you? I don't know. I, I'll, I'll look into it. Yeah, I'll look into it. Um, what was that? I don't know. You don't know your email address? I'm not sure. How, I, I'm telling you, I'm not sure. How, okay. Do you have access to the internet? Yeah. Yes. Okay. 
What I want to do, man, is give you a website. If it's something that you're interested in, um, you know, you can call me back and we can, we can, you know, get you set up for it. Do you have what, a pen and paper to take down this website? What website do you have up? It's going to be for the program I'm referring to in California. It's called you Mountainside Recovery Center. Do you have a booking number? I, I'm not sure what you mean. Okay, how long has he been there? How long has who been where? Fred Herbert. Fred Herbert. You need to find out more about this guy, like his booking number, his date of birth, so that I can uh, help Sir, you. You're you're not you're not making any sense. Wow. I I, I don't understand why you're so mad at me, sir. I, I'm not mad at you, sir. I'm trying to see what I can do to help. Okay. Just say hi, Fred, and I will know this isn't a recording. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure you know that this isn't a recording already. No. Okay, sir. Sure. Well, you're you're more than welcome to call me back when you're, when you're ready to you know looking to see see about getting some help. Okay. Well, you need to get me some better information. Well, I've been trying to, sir, and then, then you're asking me, you know, questions about where somebody is located at and, you know, information that doesn't have any bearing on the conversation. No, I did not. Okay. Well, I, I you definitely know. wish you the best of luck. You know, if, if you were serious about getting getting help, you know, we, we'd be getting a lot further with the conversation. So I'm um, sorry. When, when you're ready to look further into it, give me a call. My phone number here is 844-217-5156. I apologize.